What if it was possible to have local fresh groceries delivered right to your door? Think of all the free time you'd have. Well, Instacart gives unlimited grocery delivery for one low monthly fee. Forgot that special ingredient in your favorite dish? Instacart can deliver it to your front door in as fast as one hour. You can shop multiple stores, see deals in your area, and save time and money. I've been using Instacart for over three years. I started using them in Arizona, and I'm using them here in Florida. I love the time-saving convenience. They pick the freshest products, and they keep my eggs safe, too. To receive your first delivery free, follow the link in the show notes so that Instacart knows that we sent you and to help support the show. Instacart, never step foot in a grocery store again. Welcome to Empowered Within, a soul-quenching, transformational podcast that will set your soul on fire through candid and inspiring conversations Leading experts, celebrities, healers, and I share our journeys of how we've overcome challenges to living an empowered life from within. I'm your host, Jennifer Pilates. Welcome to another episode of Empowered Within. Hi there, and welcome back to the show. How are you? I'm so excited that you're here today. We have so much to catch up on. But first, let's talk about our summer series. So with summer comes a lot of fun energy. And it's just a great time to let your hair down, relax, and allow the sunbeams to warm your body, rejuvenate your body, mind, and spirit throughout the summer months. And so through the summer, we are doing a special series about self-care, being grateful, tuning in to ourselves while we tune out the world. That's what summer's about, right? Summer break. That's how we grew up. Yay, it's a break. So I know, yes, we all have jobs and all that kind of stuff, but we are going to embrace that spirit again. We are going to embrace our inner child and allow our inner child to feel what it used to feel like to hear that bell ring on the last day of school and rush out and yay, go be with our friends and hang out at the beach and just be. And maybe it was that you had a summer job. I know I always had summer jobs, but it doesn't matter. I still had fun. You know, there was still this lightness that was in the air with summer. And so that's what I'm excited to bring to you this summer. So it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm so excited that you're here. Let's get started. For those of you that don't know me, hi, I'm Jennifer Pilates. For over 20 years, I've been a leading voice in the health and wellness industry, helping clients all around the globe to achieve their goals and unlock their full potential. As a spiritual thought leader, I've helped countless individuals to not only improve their physical health, but also to nourish their minds and spirits. My celebrity status as a trainer and empowerment coach has earned me a reputation as one of the most sought after professionals in the field. And as an internationally renowned intuitive medium, I bring a spiritual dimension to my work that sets me apart from the rest. My approach is both practical and spiritual, and I've got this innate ability to just know things that other people maybe don't know. So whether you're looking to transform your body, elevate your mindset, or connect with your spiritual side, look no further. I've got you. Let me guide you on your journey towards becoming the best version of you. Get ready to feel empowered, inspired, and motivated like never before. You can work with me. You can head over to jenniferpilates.com and we can work together through the summer, through the fall, through the winter. Whenever you are called to do so, I will be here to help you on your journey. Let's talk about my goal and my mission for this summer, bringing it back to self, tuning in to tune out, being aware of the world around you, but knowing that's not necessarily your reality. That's my new thing. I know what's going on in the world, but that's not my reality. That's not where I'm living. That's not my vibration. I will always know what's going on, but I'm not playing in the movie. No one's paying me, so hey, I'm not playing. My goal through this beautiful summer series is that you feel empowered. I want you to feel empowered. I want you to feel inspired and motivated setting new habits and helping you to cultivate new habits this summer that are all surrounded around taking care of oneself, being selfless by learning new habits and cultivating new ideas for self-care for yourself. So throughout the summer series, we're going to be having all of these amazing talks and learning new affirmations, learning new tools and tricks to the trade that we can employ each and every week, each and every day, each and every month, some of them, that we can really set ourselves up 
as we transition from summer into fall, into winter, and into ending this year so that we can really set ourselves up for a successful half of this year. So regardless, whatever has happened, it is what it is. We are in this present moment in time. So it is this moment that matters. It is this moment that I want you to say, that sounds great, Jennifer. I'm going to take stock in myself this summer. I want to transform body, mind, and spirit and to cultivate new habits that are great, that are healthy for me, that are going to make me feel good. So what do you say we're going to have so much fun together today? Let's talk about being connected to goodness. You can be connected to goodness at any moment in time. You can be grateful for everything that is around you. The world can literally be falling apart around you and you still have the ability to find something to be grateful for. Now here's the deal. You know this is true because literally the world was kind of falling down around us the past few years and here we still are. We're still showing up for ourselves, for our significant others, for our work. I'm showing up for you. It has been two years now and we have been through the thick of it together. And I am still on a mission to empower and inspire and motivate as much as I can. And most importantly, if it is only for this one second, I truly want you to feel the energy of our community around you. I truly want you to feel that you are not alone. You are not going through anything alone. This community, myself, I am here for you. And for those of you that over the last two years of the podcast, you've written, you've sent in DMs and you've asked questions and we've worked together. Oh, it has just filled my heart with so much love. Oh my goodness. Being able to show up for all of you each and every week has been amazing. What most of you don't know is that back in September when Hurricane Ian hit, I was in Florida. For those of you that are around the world, which we have so many of you that are around the world, there was a horrific hurricane that wiped out a substantial part of Florida in September, and I was there for it, as was my family. And it was not good, as you can imagine. And for months, I lived in hotels with my fur babies, and I kept the podcast going. Well, as you know, because it's still here. I missed one day. I missed one week. It was the week of the hurricane. If you go back and look at that last week of September, there was a glitch. There was literally, it was just, it was a disaster. And then that's all I can say about that. This podcast was born during the pandemic, which was also a very difficult time. And to be able to know that it was so important for me to continue to show up for all of you every week through everything that I was going through. I didn't have a home. I didn't know whether I was coming or going. I didn't, I didn't know a lot. It was all of you that kept me going. It was all of you that kept inspiring me and motivating me. And I want to thank you for that. And so many months later, dare I count, I think it's like nine maybe, We still have not found home just yet. We, and I say yet because we are in the process of doing that now. And I had not been ready to share this before, but I'm happy to share now with all of you. I know a lot of people like to share when they're they're in their mess. And there are times when that's poignant to do because that's helpful for other people. However, this was incredibly traumatic going through this with my family and we're still in it. We still have not found our home yet. We're in the process of moving back to the East Coast, which is incredibly exciting for me. My heart has been calling four seasons for a very long time now. As many of you know, I was living in the desert for nine years out in Arizona. And then having come to Florida, I was supposed to be here for one year working vacation, which turned into family needing me, the world shutting down. And then just as I was about to move, (laughs) the hurricane came. And so there's been glitches. Um, These are pretty significant glitches. And I'm happy to report that we're on the other side of these glitches. We're not quite through it all yet. But the key word is I always say is yet because we're getting there, right? And that's what's so exciting. And that's what I want you all to know and be inspired by is that even through the, oh God, just the hell of it. I'm just going to be honest. It's been hell. I was able to show up for all of you because you all mean that much to me. I was able to co-author a book while I was living out of a hotel. I had nowhere to write and I walked down to this little river and I sat there and co-authored a book. 
This has also been the place where I have out of nowhere decided to launch my virtual Pilates studio. I've been training virtually for years, but decided to launch the studio. So you can now go and work out with me anytime, anywhere via video. I have that that was launched a couple of months ago, which is really exciting. And I'm super excited. That was launched in the middle of not having a home, not knowing what's coming or going. And launching a new aspect of business, bringing in light therapy, which has been absolutely amazing and something that I've worked with for over 13 years, which is working with stem cell activation. And it is just so amazing. And it's healing so many clients and so many people around the world that I could not share it. I have always been sharing it, but not in a business aspect. And now I'm truly sharing that in the business aspect because being a person of healing and spreading light and love around the world, how could I not share this incredible, amazing technology, which is so cool. And so again, I share all of this with you, not for any kudos by any means. The moral to my sharing this is that out of the world shutting down, we birthed this incredible podcast community that you are a part of. Out of a horrible, horrific hurricane where so many people lost their homes. Our whole community was lost and it's still rebuilding. People don't talk about it. it. Oh goodness. It's so many years and years from being recuperated. Good things can come. Now I'm not going to not tell you that there weren't times where I was literally sitting on the side of the road in my car, bawling my eyes out or calling friends going, I don't know what to do or just not knowing what to do. And sometimes the best thing you can do when you don't know what to do is you do nothing and you sit and you just be and you listen for the messages and you look for the guidance because it's in those moments where people will suddenly just show up and little things begin to unfold for you. And that's my moral to this story. Through all of this, through going through an incredible depressive state, and I don't use that word lightly, I still fought and clawed my way to do the things that I did to help myself because by helping others, I help myself. And when I show up and I serve and I'm helping others is when I feel so elated and I feel like my best self. And so it is with happiness that I can say (laughs) very soon we will no longer be displaced And we will be having our new home. And so it is with a very happy heart, full of love and excitement, that I can say that the babies and I are headed home to the East Coast. I will keep you all posted on where we end up, on how it transpires, because if you know me, you know my life is full of adventures. Nothing is ever just point A to point B. It just never is. And isn't that the beautiful, wonderful adventure that life is. I have had the opportunity, the blessing of living all over the United States in so many different places. I've gone cross country eight times recently, just a week or so ago to and from Arizona in one week. It was a wild car ride and a blessing. And I loved every minute of it. I loved being back in the desert just as much as I loved coming back here because I knew that the moment I came back here, there was going to be the switch in energy, which was going to lead me back to the East Coast where my heart is. My two hearts are the East Coast and definitely Arizona. Both of them hold very special places in my heart for very special different reasons. And so I'm really excited for everything that's to come. I'm excited for this summer series that we are going to be going along together to enlighten our body, mind, and spirits, to tune into ourself, to tune out from the world. I hope you are as excited as I am. I promise to keep you updated on my trials and tribulations because it is important to always share how we're getting through things. I really hope that from today's podcast, from today's episode, that you're taking away, wow, your world, your personal world can truly be turned upside down and it's all in your perspective and how you look at it and how you work through it because every moment in life is happening for you. It's going to take a moment to see that. It's going to take a moment to be angry and pissed off and hurt and sad and cry your way out. But that's just it. My key is it's a moment. It's a moment that you can get through. 
It's a moment that you can remember to ask God and your angels in the universe for help. You're not in it alone. And the moment that you remember that is the moment that everything shifts and the moment that you feel supported and you feel that lightness in your heart and you know that you're not alone because the truth is you are never alone. God's got you, your angels, the universe. You are never alone. With that, I will say, I cannot wait to see you on the next episode. As always, until next time, may you live an empowered life from within. Thank you so much for tuning in to another episode. Please remember to rate, review, and subscribe to Empowered Within with Jennifer Pilates. Your feedback is important. It helps me to connect with you and gives me insight into who you are and what you're enjoying about the show. For today's show notes and discount codes from today's sponsors, head over to jenniferpilates.com. Until next time, may you live an empowered life from within. 